Hello, happy Wednesday, happy hump day, all you heartful people out there. I wanted to hop on and record this moment because I think it's really, really important and it's kind of raw, um, not super raw, but anyway, today's been a very interesting day. Um, A lot of things going on in my world and it's interesting to to ponder uh, today and kind of look at things collectively and I'm quite sure most of you will relate when sometimes those of us out there that are so positive and so, you know, the world is great and there's good in everyone and all of that can have our feelings hurt. I don't know, maybe it's because I'm an empath or maybe because I'm extra sensitive to people's energies. But it's interesting that most of the time with me anyway the people that hurt my feelings the most are the ones that I know love me the most um, or I think love me the most yeah I know they love me the most and I know where their comments are coming from and it's coming from a place of love and in, actually I thought about it later and it's really probably coming from a place of uh, fear uh, on their part or they see something in me and they don't understand the whole entire story and anyway my my point in coming on here is to let you know that I become very vulnerable at times I uh, have my feelings hurt many many times and a lot of times I don't show it uh, because I like to sit with things and I like to see the positive in it. And, you know, maybe it's a reflection of me that's coming back at me to teach me something. And but today I, I it, it hurt, hurt bad, uh, badly. And it affected me all day. And, you know, had a few tears all of that I don't even think I have any mascara on anymore um, and I thought about applying makeup and all of that good stuff but I thought you know nah this is a raw moment for you you might as well look as raw as you can <laughs> so um, I am a firm believer that we have the right to our pity party but it's how long you stay at the party that matters always and when I speak to groups and uh, help individuals I talk about that and how now I only allow myself 24 hours and it's rare that I take that full 24 hours and sure enough today I was feeling a little low I crawled into bed and cried for a little while and then I thought you know do you really I know this person means well and I know the other people that along the way that love me a lot um, they mean well, but it really is it your truth or is it theirs? Right? So I decided I wasn't going to let that control me anymore. I got up, put on my hooded sweatshirt over my t-shirt, and I needed to get a few things at the store. So made my list, got in the car, and I put in my earbuds. I don't even know if I still have them on, my earbuds, my headset. And I put on my Spotify of my favorite songs. Uh, and I decided I wanted to tune everyone out for a little while because I needed to be with me for a little bit. So I walk in, uh, listening to some really great soulful music and bringing me out of it a little bit at a time. And I first place I go to is the dog toy aisle you know I've got this new puppy and I have another dog as well and the dog toys are going fast around my house so I am listening to my great music in the dog aisle dog toy aisle and this elderly couple came 
by and I could tell the guy was talking to me and I have hearing loss in this ear. So with the headset in, I it was like, and I knew that he was talking to me. So I immediately took out my headset and it was just a delight. It was just a delight. We had this really wonderful conversation about our rescues. We had this really great conversation. Gosh, am I supposed to be looking here? I, I don't know. Maybe I'm supposed to be looking here. I don't know. Anyway, the message is here. That's all that matters. Um, so we started talking and, and they, ha they have two rescues. And I said I had four, um, two dogs and then two cats. And the toys were going like crazy in my house and blah, blah, blah. And they said, you know, it, we've just come to the decision that it's, it, it's really good people that um, take in these rescues. And I was like, you know what, you're right. And I don't know, we left and I just said, hey guys. Oh, speaking of my rescues. Oh, we need to wipe some paws. Look guys. Okay. Um, so we, I had this great conversation and I don't know, my heart was just filled afterwards. And we both had, a, we all had this conversation about the fact that there are really good people out there. And I said, you know, I said, I believe that there are good people out there everywhere. And sometimes it's a matter of how much crap we allow to be stuffed down in us. And sometimes we have to dig ourselves out of that. And it was the best conversation I had all day it was like three minutes with this elderly couple in the dog aisle. And it just reminded me that it's all mindset. It's all in how you want to look at things. And don't let others have power over you. Um, as much as it might hurt to hear take it for what it's worth and where it's coming from. It might just be a place of fear for those particular people that love you dearly and they just have this perception. So my whole day shifted because I had the gift of speaking to this elderly couple for less than five minutes. So two things, don't wallow in your pity party for very long. And I'm a huge believer that there are no coincidences and everything happens for a reason. And I needed to go to the store at that moment with my headset in and I was to meet that couple because um, point number two, uh, you are who you are and you're a special gift. And the things that you have may not sit with a lot of people um, it may be different than what other people think you should do. Um, but you have to do always what is right and what is best for you. Always. Because your gift to this universe and the gift that God, Spirit, the universe, and all the angels have gifted you needs to be heard, needs to be spread. Come here, baby. It needs to be spread. Um, and we need your light. So with that, I'm so glad I'm not in my pity party anymore and I've started the grill and I'm going to grill some salmon and my kids are home and um, my dogs are home and um, the sun is setting and life is good. So be well. And if there's a story that you'd like to share with me individually, I, I just love hearing other people's stories. Or if you want to share a moment, or maybe if this assisted you in any way, please comment below. Um, let's share the light. Let's share the light. Take care. You know I love you. Peace out. <laughs>